Hey folks, Quillikeen here, and welcome to a very short video showing you how you can enable borderless windowed mode in City Skyline, or in fact in any Unity game whatsoever. Uh, if you're an advanced user, you might want to check the description box down below, but for everyone else who needs a little bit more step-by-step, -step, here it is. First of all, borderless windowed mode basically allows a game to, uh, to run, um, usually full screen-ish, but not actually um, tab you in and out if you click. For someone with a, uh, multiple monitors like me, it's really nice that I can go to my second monitor, which is what I'm doing now, and I can click on things over here, and it doesn't tab me in and out of City Skyline, which is great because I can check my email while I'm playing the game. So, um, you can enable this simply by going into your Steam. Oops, let me close this window first. Going into your Steam. You can also do this just from your actual uh, shortcut on your desktop or wherever it's installed. You're going to right-click on your game on Steam anyway. Go to Properties. And then you're going to click Set Launch Options right over here. And by doing that, it'll let you type in something. And the words you want to type in, you want to put in the minus sign, like a, hy a hyphen or a dash. It's the minus sign, followed by pop-up window. This is all one word, no spaces. And again, if you uh, check the description box down below, you'll get that. If you do that, then we are now running in uh, windowed full screen mode, which is why, for example, you can see City Skyline in the background while I have this window in the foreground and everything just keeps working and everything is awesome. Uh, and again, if you're a multi-monitor user like myself, it's really good. For the average user that probably won't care if you've only got one screen, but it's really nice. And if you do go ahead and set your, you need to make sure, sorry, I forgot about this, in your game, you still have to set it to windowed mode as opposed to full screen. If you set it to full screen, even if you use that pop-up window modifier, it's still gonna run in full screen mode, which means it's gonna tab you in and out. But if you go ahead and apply a lower resolution, um, you'll get like a borderless window that's just hanging above your desktop, which some people might want. I like to set the full resolution for my desktop and then go into borderless window because it's effectively full screen, but I can still do stuff on the other screen without having anything pop, uh, tab me in and out. And it also doesn't pause the game that way when I'm just check my email and respond to my email so I can watch my city live and my citizens be happy while I also get a little bit of work done. Thanks for watching, folks. See you next time.